Okay, let me understand this, officer. I want to get it clear, okay? Are there other media inside? Now, the thing that you need to be clear about is that you're not going inside. I you're ask you a simple question, officer. I'm not being rude or loud. I ask you a simple question. Are there media inside? I see there is media inside. Now, I'm being denied the right to go inside. Did, 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 did they read the opinion yesterday from Attorney William uh, Chapman that was in the paper? Okay. Let's make sure people can get in and out. Oh, people can get in and out. I'm not okay, blocking good. anybody very here, good. officer. Very good. Very I'm going to ask you once again, for about the third time, are other media inside? Yes, it's a yes or no question, officer. Fisher, correct? Yeah. Officer? Yeah, so uh, despite what happened yesterday, and we saw the uh, opinion of William Chapman that there's no distinguishment between other reporters and me, I am locked out of here. I guess that if I proceed to try to go in, I assume I'll get arrested. Is that right, officer? Yes. Uh -huh. Under, under whose orders is that? You're correct. Whose orders? Who, who gave you those orders, sir? I was told by the campaign that you're not welcome here. Typically. By the campaign? That's correct. I see. Is there a specific person on the campaign that told you that? How are you doing? I'm great, except for the fact that I'm uh, not allowed in. Chris? Yes. What if I ask you a couple questions? Absolutely not. Yeah. Absolutely not? Okay. Why don't you tell me, uh, you know, Tell me how to spell your name and that sort of thing. I know how to spell it already, but it's just formality. It's Christopher King, C-H-R-I-S-T-O-P-H-E-R, King, K-I-N-G, KingCast.net, Chris King's First Amendment page. Okay, so explain to me a little bit what's going on today. Well, what's going on today is the usual GOP oppression, okay? Kelly Ayotte has threatened to have me arrested like three times now in the past five years or so. Uh, there was a story written up about my complaint to the ACLU and to the city attorney in yesterday's newspaper in the Telegraph noting that uh, First Amendment media lawyer uh, William Chapman of Orton Reno said they cannot do this to me. Yet, in fact, they're doing this to me under threat of arrest, as this officer has just told me. So, uh, yeah, I'm documenting the fact that they're fascists and that they're afraid to, you know, have me answer, or ask, rather, a couple of simple questions. And, you know, I want to find out about the yeah. flip-flops. I wanted to ask John McCain. You know, he's flip-flopped a couple of times on immigration. He's flip-flopped on uh, Guantanamo Bay. He has flip-flopped on uh, Roe versus Wade, and he's flip-flopped on his wife. So how can we trust him to be uh, an elected official, much less the president? You know, I wanted to ask Kelly Ayotte if she uh, proclaims to be a mama grizzly. I wanted to ask her why is it that she allowed unconstitutional uh, DNA testing for New Hampshire youth? So these are some of the things that I wanted to ask, and they're all legitimate campaign questions, political questions. I'm not, you know, trying to incites a riot or anything of that nature. I'm a professional journalist. I'm credentialed. I've won First Amendment cases as an attorney. And here I come here, and these backwards country idiots, you know, fascist pigs, will not let me in here. And so there's got to be litigation eventually. I've got backup, and we'll go from there. All right. Thanks so much, Chris. I appreciate it. Indeed. Good to see you again. As well. Good. Officer, you were just saying earlier that it was the campaign that told you that uh, to have me arrested if I come in, correct? Is that correct? It was the campaign, correct? Yeah. Officer? Because I li I'd like you to call and ask your chief if that's, if, if that's all right. Hey, Kelly, if you're Mama Grizzly, let me ask you this. Why did you allow for unconstitutional DNA testing of uh, New Hampshire youth? I see that. I see that, sir. Okay, I'm, all right. I want to ask the candidate a question. Is that all right? No, I would like this person to be able to drive the vehicle. The person is perfectly fine. There are other people closer than I am, sir. You see that? I told you to stay on the sidewalk. And that's where I'm, that's where I'm at, right? You see that? On the sidewalk. Egress accomplished. Now, sir, you said it was the campaign that told you to arrest me, right? Could you call? I want the chief to say that. Did you, did, could you call for authority from the chief for that?
Yeah, no, and we I'm saw the opinion. Who are you with? Christopher King, KingCast.net, sir. How you doing? I'm be all right, you know. Yeah. But uh, what's your name, sir? Dave Leonard, out, Dave. Of, out of Romney. David, I support veterans. Uh, my uncle was a veteran. People in my family are veterans. But you know, Kelly A. I just because she disagrees with me has got me banned from these events oh, under really? under threat oh, really? of arrest. Oh, yes, really. And I think that's not what you went and fought and died for. No, that's no, not no, what no. people. That's not the way to be. If you don't like what I have well, to say, so, just so long as you don't, you know, stand up and protest. You know? I wasn't going to. I just wanted to ask a couple. Exactly, and that's and it's not right. Have a good. I will. You too, sir. Hi. Hi. How are you? Good. How are you? Excellent. It's a beautiful day, except for the fact that my. Uh, Freedom of the press rights have been uh, curtailed today. Yeah, that's unfortunate. Yeah. Right now, yeah, that's the way it is. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. I'm not touching you. Leave, Don't touch my leave. equipment. That's an extension of me. Leave my Don't area. touch me, you officer. They cannot area. touch me. Okay. I'm a member of the press. Yes, I do. Yes, I'm a member of NAMPA. I've been a number for a year and a half now, sir. Okay? So I don't have to go anywhere. Bases, I want to get it clear. What's the basis of Private function. Private function. Yeah. So okay. Get stuff together. We're going to head out, okay? And it's not viewpoint based discrimination. Do you want to pick your stuff up or do you have to pick it up yourself? Wait, so it's a private function. These are members of the media right here at this private function. They were. Invited. They were? Yeah. You guys get a personal advice or did you just sign in? What was your process when you got to the door, guys? So what was your process? Are you going to pick your stuff up? No, I'm just trying to figure out before that happens, officer. I just want to be clear about this, okay? It's private function. Okay. You're being asked and, to leave. And no, I'm being singled out to leave. That's what's going on. And everybody here knows it, okay? These guys are members of the media just like I am. So why am I being selected to leave? People there are asking to leave. You have to leave. It's, it's totally possible. viewpoint based discrimination. You know it is, okay? And this is, I mean, is this the hallmark? Is this, remember the GOP a couple years ago when they arrested all those people? Is this what's going on here now? Go pick up your stuff and set up. Why? I want to see where these guys got invites. Because you've been asked to leave. Because what? Because Kelly AI doesn't like me? Is that why I got asked to leave? Are you going to leave? I'm going to get arrested. Hello, Ryan. You throw me out of a meeting, that's a public open meeting, and I can call you a fascist Hitler youth. That's the First Amendment. Get used to it, kid. Person. You have been disinvited. You because why? Paid. My money's not good enough? That's right. Now leave. Why not? Why you is my money good enough? Leave I now. Want money. Oh, you, you need don't want my money out? You listen. This is oh. private property. Did you just hear him? You need to leave. And a public invite. Do the only like, reason do you, want you don't me to want call me here. the Manchester Police Department? I'd be Are you going to have a false arrest? Do you want me to call him or not? Call him. I'm fine right here. You so, sir, you flip-flopped on immigration. You flip-flopped on a number of things, sir. If you look in the reflection there, uh, you can see that there are plenty of people standing in the street and in the sidewalk. They're all there. And, you know, this is what the GOP does, though. They talk to you. They distract you. They try to do anything they can to keep you from asking, you, you, you know, a legitimate question. And it's ridiculous. You flip-flopped on immigration? If you take a look at John McCain and Kelly Ayotte's records, all you're going to see is a bunch of flip-flopping to get where they think they want to be. And that's scary. All you're going to see here, flip-flops and skeletons. And the sad part is, while they're busy making a flippy-floppy, it's the rest of America that's getting screwed. Yuck.
more of the same.